The MOS scale of mineral hardness is a qualitative ordinal scale characterizing scratch resistance of various minerals through the ability of harder material to scratch softer material. Created in 1812 by German geologist and mineralogist Friedrich Moss, it is one of several definitions of hardness in material science, some of which are more quantitative. The method of comparing hardness by seeing which minerals can visibly scratch others is, however, of great antiquity, having been mentioned by Theophrastus in his treatise on stones, c. 300 BC, followed by Pliny the Elder in his Naturalis Historia, c. 77 AD. While greatly facilitating the identification of minerals in the field, the Moss scale does not show how well hard materials perform in an industrial setting. Usage Despite its lack of precision, the Moss scale is highly relevant for field geologists, who use the scale to roughly identify minerals using scratch kits. The Moss scale hardness of minerals can be commonly found in reference sheets. Moss hardness is useful in milling. It allows assessment of which kind of mill will best reduce a given product whose hardness is known. The scale is also in use at digital electronic manufacturers, for testing the resilience of certain flat panel display components such as cover glass for LCDs or encapsulation for OLEDs. Minerals the Moss scale of mineral hardness is based on the ability of one natural sample of mineral to scratch another mineral visibly. The samples of matter used by Moss are all different minerals. Minerals are chemically pure solids found in nature. Rocks are made up of one or more minerals. As the hardest known naturally occurring substance when the scale was designed, diamonds are at the top of the scale. The hardness of a material is measured against the scale by finding the hardest material that the given material can scratch, or the softest material that can scratch the given material. For example, if some material is scratched by apatite but not by fluorite, its hardness on the Moss scale would fall between 4 and 5. Scratching A material for the purposes of the Moss scale means creating non-elastic dislocations visible to the naked eye. Frequently, materials that are lower on the Moss scale can create microscopic, non-elastic dislocations on materials that have a higher Moss number. While these microscopic dislocations are permanent and sometimes detrimental to the harder material's structural integrity, they are not considered scratches. For the determination of a Moss scale number, the Moss scale is a purely ordinal scale. For example, corundum 9 is twice as hard as topaz 8, but diamond 10 is four times as hard as corundum. The table below shows the comparison with the absolute hardness measured by a sclerometer, with pictorial examples. On the Moss scale, a streak plate unglazed porcelain has a hardness of approximately 7.0. Using these ordinary materials of known hardness can be a simple way to approximate the position of a mineral on the scale. Intermediate hardness The table below incorporates additional substances that may fall between levels. Comparison with Vickers scale Comparison between hardness Moss and hardness Vickers. See also References Further reading Moss Hardness of Elements is taken from G. V. Samsonov ed., in Handbook of the Physiochemical Properties of the Elements, IFI Plenum, New York, USA, 1968. Cordua, William S. The Hardness of Minerals and Rocks. Lapidary Digest, c. 1990.